Hey yo, look like I'm going for a swim. Dunk on him now, I'm swinging off the rim. Bitch ain't coming off the bench. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl KP back in the cup with another video. And I have my awesome, somewhat awesome, get on my nerves, boyfriend today, AJ, and better known as Austin, NASA, all that. Um, Alright, so the first question um, I got was, why do black people like Hennessy? Well, first of all, that's very inaccurate. I don't like Hennessy. I like Hennessy. I don't like Hennessy. I like, like pure white Hennessy. It tastes like bitter goat milk. How do you know what goat milk tastes like? I've been some places. Shut up. Um, so this, this too, like, well, I don't, I mean, I don't prefer Hennessy. I like it, but I don't prefer it. I tell you what, though. Well, tell them. I like crying out. I gotta I have like it. I like New Amsterdam, too, you know, that ain't brown, but, mm, especially that apple kind. All right, the next one is, why do black people have big noses? So we know that that is not true because I don't have a big nose. I have a very small nose. Um, it may look big on person in, in the camera, but I definitely have a small nose. He has a big nose. Yeah, it's, it's not that big. He got a bell flipper. It's not that big. So black people don't all have black, big noses, just, and just the just, ones of us that do. Just because you um, got an orange cutie on your face. <laughs> The ones of us that do have big noses, um, we can say that's just genetics, I guess. Um, let's see. The next one is, why do black people get to say the N-word? Because if a white person said it's disrespectful. But why do black people get to say it? <laughs> because it's our word now. We took it from them. Okay. Um, so personally, I don't, I don't so, condone anyone saying it. So would you get madder at a black person saying it or a white person? I would get madder at an Asian. That wasn't the question I asked you. <laughs> I would get mad at an Stick Asian. Stick to the script. <laughs> okay, so if, if it was The a, script. If it was a white or a black person saying it, I mean, it's equally wrong, but like, if if a white person says it, I'm gonna feel like you're trying to, you know, say some shit. But um, uh, uh, so I'm gonna say white. My nigga. <laughs> That's out, my favorite part of training day. Shout out to Denzel Washington. That's okay, so the next one nigga. is why do black people run faster? Because we built better. We, we built stronger. I'm gonna tell you straight up, I we run slow need, as shit. We don't, we don't need steroids. I'm gonna tell you this, I run yeah. slow. A need. Ain't no way in H E L L if it's me and a lion running against each other. I'm gonna be eight. Plus we got better protein in our legs. You, you ever know? seen a lion attack a gazelle? That's exactly what it's gonna be like. So. When I see French fries. I want some French fries. Cheese fries, chili. I ate those the other day. At the house. Anyway. <laughs> we have like food problems. We, we love to eat, if you haven't noticed. Um, Fried chicken. Fun fact, I don't like chicken on the bone. I don't like anything on, on the bone, period. Like ribs. But you got ribs. I don't like my food on the bone. <laughs> Let me say that. Be more specific. It's specific. Specific. It's specific. Specific. All right. Anyway, so the next question knock, is knock. for me: What are black girl edges? Where yours is? It? I just playing. You're right there. Don't do me. I have edges, y'all. I definitely have edges. Um. So black girl edges. I would have to say. Um, I can't say when we slick them down with Eco Styler or um, Edge Control, 
but definitely black girl edges are like when we like do the, like the little baby hairs and swoop down our sideburns and have them looking all nice and smooth and <laughs> have them looking nice and smooth <laughs> have them looking nice and smooth um so i guess that's what you would say black girl edges are um so one of the questions that i did see is why do black men <laughs> like white women <laughs> Cause they don't talk as much as black women. Okay. Alrighty then. On to the next question. Um. <laughs> so, what is black girl magic? We're gonna. I don't know it. that one. What is black girl magic? I found. Oh, he found it. Um, what is Black Girl Magic? It is the concept and movement that was popularized by Kashawn Thompson. Who? Thompson. Who? Thompson. It is Thompson. <laughs> Thompson. Thompson. Well, you gotta spell it, Thompson. Thompson. It is spelled Thompson. It's Thompson. Thom thom thom. <laughs> Y'all, he be working my last damn nerves. That thong, 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 thong. Okay, Kashawn Thompson. What was I? The In concept was born a way to celebrate the beauty and power and resilience of Black African America women. <laughs> I am on the path to be a strong <laughs> black African America man. Okay, I'm gonna insert the I'm clip. I'm gonna walk like a man, talk like a man. I'm gonna insert the clip of Andrew Cole. <laughs> now, shit, I hear you talking, but you need to convince me. I am going to follow his footsteps of being a strong black African America man. Oh, my pixie dust. Did this nigga say America? Say it with your chest, nigga. I'm a strong black African American, light skinned with a woman now. And what we gonna do when we get out here in these streets? Cause you ain't taking no more me. Man, I'm a walk like a man, talk like a man, be a man. Hey, that's my motherfucking dog right there, nigga. That's what I'm talking about. Nigga, roof, nigga, roof, roof, nigga. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, nigga, damn, man. Stop blowing shit. <laughs> Hey, so. <laughs> you okay, so, goddamn black and bald I'm head. not bald head. I have my hair, right? Okay, so in my perspective, mm -hmm. I prefer mm -hmm. to wear a wig or a weave um, because it's less maintenance and it's like a quick and easy hairstyle. Because if I can literally just put on a wig in the morning and go, my day is made easier and I can get out the door quicker. Um, but except for the fact that no one ever mentions the fact that some of us women are in such of a rush that we leave our wig at home and then we had that weird looking stocking cap on that had that little patch of concealer on it. But um, let's see. Why do black men why do black men have 
So the next question is really, really, really racist. Um, it's for Austin, and it says, why do black men not take care of their children? I ain't got no kids. It says, why do black men not take care of their children? Well, let me be serious for a second, because I got a long answer. Part one, volume one in the book of Brown. Um, I think that most men that don't take care of their kids it's because they don't want to deal with the mothers. That's part of the reason. Because the mothers make it so hard. So you're condoning them not taking care I'm of not, the kids I'm of not the mother? I'm not condoning anything. Okay. I'm just telling you a reason. Okay. So in your shoes. In their way, they don't want to deal with the mother. Point number two. Is it, I thought it was volume two. Volume two. They ain't got no money, and they scared, and they not ready. And they want to keep playing games. So that makes it okay? No. I did, Disclaimer, I do not condone not taking care of your kids. Okay, thank you. <laughs> and uh, if you got kids, uh, you better... Uh, Take care because God is looking at you saying you got all this money, but your kids are wearing airwalks to school. You got all this money when you got polo, but your kid is wearing eyes away. You got all this money when you're wearing Hollister jeans, but your kids are wearing faded glory. about how they don't take care of their kids. Are you sure you're done? No. You can't put time on the Lord. And another note. God, he going to have that spiritual paddle and pop her right on the rope. Watch what I tell you. Okay, so this one is another question. It says, why do black girlfriends be mean? Because y'all bitter. Because we're what? Y'all bitter on the inside. Y'all like bitter milk. Y'all like beer. <laughs> and that goes back to the, the, the why do black men like white girls? They not mean. Black girl, y'all put too much work in for them to be nice to you. I'm sorry, you date a black girl. You gotta put too much work in for them to be nice to you. You date a black girl. But they don't do all that talking back. You date a black girl. She's really white. On the inside. Ain't no racial around here. She got that uh, disease that uh, Uncle Rooker's got. Okay, this one says, why do black girlfriends ignore me? <laughs> That's what a team, it was a white person that typed in this question on Google. Nine times out of ten. Black girls just don't like you. Hate yourself. Alright, so the next one is why do black boyfriends bleed every time? Why we what? Bleed every time. <laughs> okay, whoever tried that. Where are they bleeding from is the question. Okay, so the next one is, why do black boyfriends cheat? 
So you can't just say black boyfriends because white boyfriends do it too. I mean, that's what the question says. It says literally. You can't see. That can't even there. see it, guys. Y'all can't even see it. I'm sorry. So it says, "Why do black boyfriends cheat?" Um, well, I've only had two boyfriends cheat on me, and they one of them was white, one of them was black. So it's not just um, black guys that are cheating. Um, it definitely is any race that can cheat on you, um, for sure. But the next one says, um, "Why do black boyfriends break up with you?" Like question question. Question. You can't just say black boy, you gotta say boyfriend if you're gonna ask that because these Okay, so this question says where do black guys come from? We come from our um we come from our father's meat pistol. What? So black guys to me, they definitely come from their mother, because mother, their mother is God. So I'm gonna have to stick with that one. This one. Shout out, shout out to uh my boy Bass Man. If he watches it. If he watches this, just wouldn't let him know. He's the number four drummer in the world. So that's all the questions that we could find on um, Google today. So definitely if you guys like this video, um, definitely comment, like, and subscribe. And also go follow Austin's channel. Tell them how to follow you. Uh, just look up Austin Brown, hashtag drummers on YouTube. Um, also follow me on uh, Twitter. And Instagram, my Twitter account is the new kid dynamite, and my Instagram is the one they call Jerome. A period between each word. So the one dot. The dot one dot. They dot call dot Jerome. Okay. So as always, y'all can follow me on my social medias, which will be at the end of the video. Of course, it's always what is my Instagram? I have no clue. I'll put it at the end of the video. Also, go check out my new merch um, website down below. You could be able to find the link. Um, the shirts change every week, so y'all be able to look at um, the merchandise differently every week. So most importantly, um, always let your light shine before men. Um, and I hope that you guys love this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And you guys have a great day. Bye. Hey, yo. Look like I'm going for a swim. Dunk on them now. I'm swinging up the rim. Bitch ain't coming off the bench.